Hello everyone and welcome back to this video. So in this video tutorial, I'm actually going to show you how to use the Bybit P2P trading interface, okay? How to buy crypto, how to sell crypto and all of that. If you want to deposit, if you are new to Bybit and you want to make deposit, okay? You want to convert your fiat to, you know, uh, crypto and all of that. That is exactly what I'll be showing you in this video. So for you to be able to follow up, you need a Bybit account. If you don't have an account already, use the link in the video description to sign up for an account, all right? So the first thing we need to do is after you've, you know, Sign up for an account, you log into your account. This is what the Bybit app looks like. And once you log into your account, you want to come to this option that says buy crypto on the app. All right. Uh, in your own case, maybe if it is P2P trading that is showing there, it's still the same thing. All right. Just click on the buy crypto option and that will bring us to this page. Okay. Once it brings us to this page, by default, it will bring you to the one click buy. All right. So let me start from here. On the one click buy, I can decide to buy any crypto asset of my choice with zero fee directly from my bank account. Okay. So with the one click, buy recently introduced what they call the hot swap option on the P2P marketplace, which is on this one click. So if I go ahead and click on this option here, I can go ahead and buy any token of my choice here. If I want to buy the APT token, I can go ahead and put that. And how much do I want to spend? I can say I want to spend 20,000, all right? So I can spend 20,000 and go ahead and buy the APT token, all right? So if you want to know more about the one click buy, I made a video recently, you can check out that video right now. Now, after the one click by the next option there, if I go ahead and click on this arrow, it will show us more options that we have. So I go ahead and click on that. We have the P2P, all right? On the P2P marketplace, the only coins you can trade here, if I come in here and I go ahead and click, okay, on the arrow here, you see that the only coins or tokens you can buy and sell here is USDT, USDC, BTC, and Ethereum. This is the difference between this and the one click buy. On the one click buy, I can actually buy any token of my choice directly from my bank account, but here on the P2P, okay, you will need to first buy any of these tokens, all right? These are the limited tokens you can buy on the P2P marketplace. So if I buy Ethereum and I want to change it to um, Arbitrum, then I need to go to the spot market or use the convert option to do that, all right? So here on the P2P marketplace, if I want to buy, I'm on the buy tab and I want to buy USDT. So you get different quotations from different sellers, all right? So these are the people I can buy from. Now, if I want to buy USDT from this first person, which seems cheaper, okay, it means that I will be looking at the limit, all right? Look at the limit of what this person is ready to sell from 900 to 7,000. Okay, what if you want to buy a million naira worth of, you know, USDT? It means that you cannot buy from that person. The next person is selling from 1,000 to 23,000. Okay, if you are buying above that, you cannot buy from that person. And it goes down, all right? So the more I scroll down, the more you see the limits, okay? 3,000 to 100K and all of that. So when you see somebody who can sell what you want, you can go ahead and buy. And you can look at how many transactions, okay, that these persons have completed and, you know, they are rate in you know uh, in percentage and all of that okay now if i want to buy what a million naira and instead of scrolling down until i see the person that will sell that i can go ahead and click on this amount option all right so if i go ahead on the amount option i can go ahead and type in here that i want to buy one million naira worth of you know um, usdt click on confirm and this will automatically filter those who will sell anything from one million and above for you all right so here you see that this person is selling from 15k to 23 million okay this person from 50,000 to 23 million okay 50,000 to 23 million and all of that so i can go ahead now and buy from any of these persons so if i want to buy from this first person i just go ahead and click on buy and once i click on buy i'll go ahead and put in the amount here okay so let's say I want to buy one million naira worth of that. I'll go ahead and put in the amount there, and it will tell you the worth of you know the USDT you will receive in return. Okay. So if you're okay with this, okay, you can go ahead and click on the buy with zero fee option here, and that will take you to the next page where you will actually you know um, you know make payment to the person's bank account. You need to do like a bank transfer to the person's bank account, and once you transfer the money to the person's bank account, what happens? The person will now release that crypto and the crypto will be deposited into your funding wallet on the Bybit exchange. Then you can use this to buy or trade or do whatever you want to do. All right. The same thing happens if you want to sell. All right. If you want to sell asset, any of this asset to your bank account, you go ahead and click on the sell option. So if I switch to the sell option, the same thing. Okay. You search for the traders 
who are ready to buy remember that we actually use 1 million plus okay that is why you are seeing okay the you know filter we put here as 1 million is why you are seeing all of this high amounts here okay so if i want to sell for, to this person i'll go ahead and sell or the same thing the same process okay if i click on the sell option so it tells you price has changed just go ahead and click on confirm okay and then click on the sell option again and this will come up all right so it means that you need to be having usdt in your funding wallet to be able to sell so i can put in the amount of usdt i want to sell here and then i will select the bank account if you don't have a bank account link up with your bybit account already you can just you know click on this option to add up your bank account okay you can click there to add your bank account details and that's all all right so and adding bank account it means that the name of the bank account you are adding should correspond with the name on your bybit account to avoid okay problems when you are using the p2p marketplace so i just click on sell and the person will be able to transfer depending on the bank account that i've selected here yeah, the person will be able to transfer money into my bank account okay and then the crypto once i receive the alert i'll come in here and say that i've received that option because there's there will be a button that will appear here that say release crypto okay so you go ahead and click on release crypto and the crypto will be released to the person now one thing you should know is that you cannot cheat anybody on the bybit you know p2p marketplace all right once you click on sell bybit will lock your crypto asset until that transaction is completed and once you click on buy bybit will lock the crypto asset until that transaction is completed so you cannot cheat anybody here all right okay so that is basically how to use the p2p marketplace so the last option here on the buy bait um you know p2p marketplace is the option called the fiat deposit so if i click on that option there you see where it says fiat deposit okay this is actually for you know a specific country so if you click here right here and you see your currency there it means that you can actually deposit any of this okay in any of this currency directly to your Bybit account, all right? So these are the supported currencies that you can actually deposit from. If you want to deposit that, you can go ahead and they give you, you know, the payment option, depending on any of these you selected, okay? They'll give you different payment option that you can use to make those deposit into your Bybit account, all right? So that is basically how to use the Bybit P2P trading option to buy, sell crypto directly from your bank account and all of that okay so if you have any question you can use the comment section and once again if you don't have a bybit account guys use the link in the video description to sign off for an account and if you want to become a bybit p2p merchant you can go ahead and do that once you sign off for an account join my telegram group okay using the link in the video description and let me know i'll be able to link you up so that your merchant account can be activated and you can be doing buying and selling on the bybit p2p marketplace and be making money for yourself all right if the video is helpful give it a thumbs up and i'll see you guys in my next video